This song I had wrote when I was in a little bit more of an angry mood, and those songs tend to have quite a bit of attitude behind them. In 2015, I had recorded my debut album, and I was looking for support within the music industry to help promote it. Um, Talking with radio stations, with labels, managers, you name it. And it was during the whole, you know, like, bro country phase where girls were really fighting for spots at radio, spots with labels. It was just very risky for someone to get behind promoting a female artist because radio wasn't playing them and they weren't playing them because the fans weren't wanting to listen to them. So it was such a sad time in the music industry. Things are getting better, but there's still a long ways to go. Anyway, I had talked with so many people and the thing that really frustrated me was I got turned down not because they weren't impressed by my vocal ability or the songs it had to do strictly with that I was a female artist they didn't have room for me and it was too big of a risk so that was very disheartening and then it got worse because I was seeing so many artists um, some of them with you know horrible reputations you know some of them were womanizers or just very ungrateful for the opportunities that they were being given. And they were getting signed, they were getting picked up by radio stations all the time. And I got so angry and frustrated. So I kind of channeled all this anger that I was feeling towards so many people in the music industry that had that sexist type of attitude that were limiting me. And I created this metaphorical character, kind of a cowboy Casanova to take my anger out on in this song. And then, you know, in the grander scheme of things, I wanted the song to be relatable to my listeners. So I thought, well, what what girl hasn't had that type of guy come hit on them in the bar who who thinks they have total control of the situation and they're just a creep? Or maybe they have that kind of guy that they work with in the office that just treats them horrible and You need to stand up to those kind of guys and uh, take control of a situation. So this song is called Hard to Get. Sipping on Jack and two tight wranglers All that talking, baby, no swagger Looking for a one-night fling Say me and you should get out of this bar Gonna love me all night under a blanket of stars Oh, thinking I'm a sure thing Trying hard to bend my will But I ain't falling for your cheap feels And I won't say no, bed no chalk Don't want no sugar in my Dixie cup Your daddy raised you up a ladies man Your mama tried to make you understand that girls like Hard to get, I don't give it away, you gotta show respect I don't want your cowboy loving cliche fool Boy, you still got learning to do Keep buying me shots, but I already know That you won't pick me up cause your truck's full of chrome Don't you know that shit's getting old You think you got the right moves figured out But from what I see, you know nothing about How to make a girl lose control I've had your kind before And it's never left me wanting more And I won't play it, no, bed, no truck Don't want no sugar in my Dixie cup Your daddy raised you up a ladies' man Your mama tried to make it understand that Play hard to get, I don't give it away, you gotta show respect I don't want your cowboy loving cliche fool Boy, you still got learning to do Boy, you think you're gonna run the world But at the end of the day, you're gonna run it by a girl Sit on down, boy, you're about to get tired when it comes to me I call the shots And now I won't lay in no bed, no truck Don't want no sugar in my Dixie cup Your daddy raised you up a ladies' man Your mama, she tried to make it understand That girls like me play hard to get I don't give it away, you gotta show respect I don't want your cowboy-loving cliche fool Boy, you 
still got learning to do. Oh, you still got learning to do.